The Shokan and Centaurians have resumed skirmishing. Send me, Mother. I'll end their dispute. <laughs> Round one, fight! Sub-Zero, Chameleon. We would both benefit from an alliance. You expect trust after what you've done? <laughs> <laughs> General Shao, Goro. My mother's blood is on your hands! Yours will be too if you don't surrender! <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Imagined. May it prove more escapable than the Nether Realm. Round one. Fight.
Shang Tsung, Quan Chi. You will regret having found me, Empress. Only if you leave this fight alive. <laughs> might react. I met with Baraka to discuss his Tarkatans. Speaking from his heart, he moved me. I agreed to visit his colony and see how his people lived. The conditions were atrocious. This was one of my mother's few mistakes. Like all Outworlders, she treated Tarkatans with scorn. What they deserved from us was compassion. And the only way to get it for them was to reveal my affliction. To show all my subjects that even an Empress could get Tarkat. The scandal my revelation caused was intense. But with the help of Katana and Tanya, I emerged from it a stronger Empress than ever. My honesty, empathy, and resolve won over my remaining doubters. There is no longer any question that I am fit to lead the Empire. Once I rule, Outworld won't be submissive. The throne will never be yours. <laughs> Fight! <laughs> <laughs> 
Sindel wins. Thermac. Sub Zero. You must trust us with your husband's soul. How? You were born of the darkest magic. With one act, you betrayed two realms. Neither deserved my loyalty. Homelander. 
Sonya Blade. I'm faster, I'm smarter, and I'm too pompous to let live. Your katana is as weak-willed as mine. Or is it you confuse compassion for fragility? <laughs> Heartless, yes. Spineless, no.
enveloped me. I took a long last look at my family. I did not expect to see them again until their souls joined mine in the living forest. But miraculously, my beloved husband delivered me from oblivion. Though he couldn't save my body, Jared had preserved my soul. Like him and countless others, I am now a part of Ermac. Yet ours is not a peaceful repose. The collected souls within Ermac have their own needs and agendas. Before we can speak as one, we must first reach consensus. I had thought, as the former rulers of Outworld, I and Jared would hold sway. But here we are, two souls among many thousands, fighting for the right to be heard. And if there is one thing we do well together, it is fight. We will win the right to govern Ermac as we once had governed Outworld. And we will rule for the benefit of all.